Hey there, doers. My name is Jose Ignacio. Subscription products offer predictable revenue and stronger customer relationships, transforming industries worldwide. We already track sales through revenue reports. Now today, we're going to use Odoo subscription app reporting features to analyze key aspects of your subscription business. So enough chit chat, let's dive in. Here I am on my main subscription analysis dashboard. Firstly, we're going to select reporting up at the top and then subscriptions right there. Now churn is one of the most important metrics for subscription businesses because it allows us to track customers who are not renewing with us. Once again, they are not going to be joining us again. Now let's switch right now to a different view because I need to get more visibility. We're going to select in the top right our little chart icon. Well, it's more of a table actually, and this gives us a pivot table, which also has more detailed breakdowns of all of our data. Up next, we need to select the right measure. So on that note, we're gonna click the word measures over here, and then we're gonna click on count because that's going to track the number of ended subscriptions for us right there. We're gonna keep the monthly recurring measure over here checked as well, since it's a pretty good metric to track. We're gonna close out of that real quick. All right, immediately I wanna clear out these default filters up here in the search bar, just because I wanna do my own. All right, now this time around, we're gonna filter by what did I say we were doing? Churn. Okay, so now the report is already broken out or broken down in this case by salesperson. But let's make sure we are also grouping it by the end date. So once again to the search bar, we're gonna select our end date over here in the middle group by option and select month. All right, I think this all looks really good. I'm gonna wanna use this a lot. And how do I do that? Well, oh doers. We're gonna save this report by clicking save current search over here in the far right. And what are we gonna name this one? We're gonna call it monthly churn analysis. All right. And in this case, I'm gonna make this my, we're not gonna do a default filter actually. There we go. Now we've got it right there. All right, and now we've actually analyzed churn. But I also wanna see my customer revenue. So let's actually create a comprehensive subscription health report by combining multiple metrics. We're gonna use the same subscriptions analysis report with some modifications by adjusting those types of filters. So let's reset this by selecting reporting and subscriptions once again. All right, I need to add a filter for the state of a subscription and we're gonna get rid of the paused one over there up at the top because we're focusing on active subscriptions. Now let's actually group our data in a meaningful way. So we're gonna go up here up to the top again and this time we're under group by, we're gonna select product, perfect. And that way we can see our performance by subscription product. And let's actually switch once again to that pivot view. I'm not going to stop using it. Okay, so let's click measures. And this time around, which one do I want? Well, this time I'm gonna want recurring revenue. Then I'm also gonna want count. All right, this shows revenue and subscription count by product. Let's add another grouping to analyze product performance over time. So inside of the pivot view that we have over here, I want you to select the word total. We're gonna select it again, just to add something here. We're going to select first contract date and then month. All right, now we're cooking once again. Now this report provides a comprehensive view of our subscription business by product and month, enabling us to identify growing and declining products and optimize our strategy. Let's save this custom report over here by clicking on, once again, save current search. And what are we gonna name this one? We're gonna call this product performance. Very business words, analysis. Oh, beautiful, great. Now I can actually regularly check this and stay up to date on our performance. Now it's actually time for you to put this knowledge into practice by creating your own subscription reports and see what insights you discover. Thanks for watching, Odoo. See you next time. Go grab a snack. I still don't have any in front of me.